I want to take the time to say thank you to my patrons. Your help has actually not only done so much for my channel, but has actually helped me personally to make it through this tough year. And I want to thank all of my subscribers and well, thank you. And let's get to the show. So, check this out. I'm going to practice my concern face. Nah, I fucking ain't doing as stupid as Tucker Carlson. Oh, 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 oh. So, this is, um, um, sort of a news thing, sort of a news kind of cycle. Um, yeah, um, so... If you don't know who Matt Gates is, first of all, counter star is lucky. Um, secondly, um, you don't follow politics because he was the main Trump bootlicker. Well, I guess he would have been the second main Trump bootlicker. If, if we if we remember back um here. Let's just bring this up. This is Trump's main bootlicker. Now, I don't know. I don't know. If somebody actually called my wife ugly, said my father was the um was involved in the JFK shooting. And if I said that um if I said that I wanna Stand, take a principal stand against this um, against this person. I wouldn't be doing this shit right here. That's a sad, sad man. That is a sad, sad fucking man. God, that's a sad man. <laughs> mm. Mm. Oh, the tears are delicious. The tears are motherfucking delicious. <laughs> Um, but, 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 um, we're not here to dunk on Raphael Cruz. We're not. <laughs> it just looked like, he, uh, it just was like sad. Oh shit. Okay. 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 Um, let's get to the video. Um, we're here to talk about Matt Gates and, um, his recent vi visit to Tucker Carlson. Now, Tucker Carlson is actually going to do more of the setup for me um, than I need to because um, this is going to be funny and I get to criticize him after. Here we go. Just a couple of hours ago, late this afternoon, the New York Times ran a story saying that Florida Congressman Matt Gates is under federal investigation for playing some role in sex trafficking and potentially having a relationship with a 17-year-old girl. There are very few details in major news outlets tonight about this story. We have no background on it all and not even any very informed questions. All right, so, um, like, um, news, like, you know, news flash of the Republican, a Florida Republican part congressman is preying on, you know, teens. Wow. Wow. <laughs> but newsflash, or, or a Florida Republican congressman is preying on teens. Wow. 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 This 39-year-old man, or wait, is he 37-year-old man, is preying on teens. Fuck, what, what does the South say? Like, if, if they're old enough to vote, then they're, they're, they're aged out of the dating population? Like, like, is it just a thing that, like, a lot of these politicians in the South, especially of the Republican kind, just like teenagers? Like, I don't fucking get it. Wow. Okay. Okay. Let's let's go. What's what's up? Um, what's what's up, um, Villa? Um, let let let's go. Instead, we've invited Congressman Gates on the show to respond to these stories and give us his view of them. 
Congressman, thanks so much for coming on. I appreciate it. Um, so this is obviously a serious allegation. Tell us what the truth is from your perspective. It is a horrible allegation and it is a lie. The New York Times is running a story that I have. Okay, okay, okay. So you guys heard that shit, right? You guys heard that shit that it is a lie. It's a horrible story and it's a lie. It is a horrible story and it's a lie. It's a horrible story and it's a lie. And Tucker is having his same constipated look faced all, you know, he has his, his just constipated look, but let's go. Traveled with a 17 year old woman and that is verifiably false. People can look at my travel records and see that that is not the case. What is happening is an extortion of me and my family involving a former Department of Justice official. On March 16th, my father got a text message demanding a meeting wherein a person demanded $25 million in exchange for making horrible sex trafficking allegations against me go away. Oh, look, he's being embezzled. He's being embezzled. He's being embezzled. Oh, 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 wait, 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 wait. Where's my world's smallest violin for the piece of shit Matt Gates, who also was one of those motherfuckers that still supported the insurrection after the insurrection happened. All that boot licking of Donald Trump and Trump's Justice Department literally was investigating him for sex trafficking. But let's continue. Our family was so troubled by that, we went to the local FBI. And the FBI and the Department of Justice were so concerned about this attempted extortion of a member of Congress that they asked my dad to wear a wire, which he did with the former Department of Justice official. Tonight. Oh, oh, oh. so you know that these motherfuckers are either incapable of actually committing crimes or just so brazen that he doesn't think he's going to get caught. How many people, even if you haven't been in trouble with the law, no, not to tell somebody that you're wearing a wire or not to get on national news and saying that you're wearing a wire. Like, ooh, 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 ooh. I am not a criminal. I know some people may think because of the brown skin and shit like that, I made no criminal attack. I watch a lot of movies and I know you don't say you're wearing a wire. You don't tell people that you're wearing a wire. Like, like, are you just motherfucking, like, are you just motherfucking stupid or you just like think that you know you should get away with it by the way um why does matt gates look as if he's like remember lazy town remember old dude the like the really good actor that unfortunately he did pass but he had like a plastic face looking like thing like matt gates look like his face is fucking plastic like whoa, oh god it, it just looks, his face doesn't look fucking real. Now, of course, he has another punchable face, but his face doesn't look fucking real. I'm, I'm getting off on a tangent. Let's go. I am demanding that the Department of Justice and the FBI release the audio recordings that were made under their supervision and at their direction, which will prove my innocence and that will show that these allegations aren't true. They're merely intended to try to bleed my family out of money. And this former Department of Justice official tomorrow was supposed to be contacted by my father so that specific instructions could be given regarding the wiring of $4.5 million as a down payment on this bribe. I don't All right. So, no, it's not a bribe. It's uh, it's extortion. It's not, not a bribe. It's, you bribe people that's in power. This person is not in power. It's a former. For oh, my God. You can't even get your terminology right. It's, oh, oh God. Oh. Mm. Oh. Um, but yeah, um, like this, fuck, this anger that he's actually showing is as bad as the fucking stupid ass background that he's in, in behind him. We know that that's not a real background. We know that you're on a green screen, dog. You don't have to act like you are. Oh, God. Okay. 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 But again, I stopped it too because he wants to again assert his innocence like he is innocent he he did not have sexual relations with that woman he does not know who this woman is let's go i don't think it's a coincidence that tonight somehow the new york times is leaking this information smearing me 
and ruining the investigation that would likely result in uh, one of the former colleagues of the current DOJ being brought to justice uh, for trying to extort me and my family. So a, co a couple of obvious questions that come to mind, and again, just to restate, this just happened. Don't have any other information beyond what we've already said and you have said. Mind you, this was a couple of days ago. We have a lot more inf information. They have been looking after his ass for a long time. They actually have the records. I'm just saying, like, yeah, Tucker, you, you should have, like, vetted him. I know he's, like, your, 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 your fellow sycophant when it comes to Donald Trump. But um, you, you shouldn't have, like, no, you, no, you shouldn't have had him on your show. And we're going to see in a minute why. Let's go. Um, who, first of all, who is this Department of Justice former employee who's trying to extort the money from you, you say? His name is David McGee. He was a top official in the leadership in the Northern District of Florida as a prosecutor. He currently works at the Beggs and Lane Law Firm. As a matter of fact, one of the recordings that was made at the FBI and Department of Justice request occurred at that law firm. And the money that was supposed to be paid today that would have shown even more evidence of David McGee's work in this extortion scheme, that was foiled by the New York Times story. And I believe that's why this, uh, this horrible information and these terrible allegations have been used this evening. Like, notice he's not saying that he currently works for the Department of Justice. Notice he's not saying that. Notice he's actually saying that, oh, this is... He, he's a former one. He, he works for this law firm. And, like, it's almost as if something changed where so a Department of Justice person may not, like, uh, what, what happened that he may be former Department of Justice? How long ago was that former actually been, had, had been instated? Like, how long? How, like, you guys know I'm getting there, but let's go. So you're, and, and I'll get the investigation in a sec, but, but you're saying that David McGee was motivated by greed. He was trying to extort money from your family. That's his motivation, you're saying. Uh, I know that there was a demand for money in exchange for a commitment that he could make this investigation go away along with his co-conspirators. They even claim to have specific connections inside the Biden White House. Now, I don't know if that's true. They were promising that- Wait, 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 wait. I just, I just, just caught this, right? I just caught this, right? So, what's interesting to me, a Department of Justice person actually was trying to contact you and extort money out of you, but they're, like, is it me or does it sound like the, the, the guy that he's talking about was actually working for him to help him cover up some shit, and he just flipped on him because... Oh shit, this is out in the public. Oh shit, I need to do something about it. Like, you know you have those fixers. We know fixers happen. It's not just the TV. It's not just the um, scandal bullshit. It's not just the Ray Donovan shit. Like, we know fixers happen. Trump actually had a fixer. Um, his fixer actually paid um, 50 grand to his mistress during the presidential campaign, which was another illegal, um, uh, illegal thing that Trump did. So... Your fixer was trying to get some shit fixed for you, and now you're going to flip on him? That's fucking disgusting, dog. That's disgusting as shit because it looks like when you fuck up the fixer. Nah, they didn't arrest him. They didn't arrest him yet, but like, yeah, this is, this is, they, they working on the shit. They working on the shit, man. Joe Let's Biden go. would pardon me. Obviously, I don't need a pardon. I'm not seeking a pardon. I've not done anything improper or wrong. But what I am troubled by uh, is the real motivation for all of this. You know, just tonight, Ted Lieu, a Democrat, is calling on me to be removed from the House Judiciary Committee. And I believe we are in an era of our politics now, Tucker, where people are smeared to try to take them out of the conversation. I'm not. Wait, 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 wait. A criminal. Somebody is saying a criminal, a suspected criminal, should be removed. From something that, uh, from a committee that deals with laws. Wait, 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 wait. I thought Republicans were actually big. I thought Republicans were actually big on making sure criminals don't have say so in political dealings. Or people that were suspected of being criminals. Or people that may have performed criminal acts. I thought they were real big on that. Especially Florida public, uh, politicians. Because remember, the people in Florida actually passed a law to allow um to allow felons to vote again but the republican legislature legislation straighter ah 
legislation. Uh, fuck it. The Republican con um, House of Representatives in Florida and the Senate actually overturned that law because they didn't want criminals to vote because they were black people. Well, mostly black people. Yeah. No. Fuck. Like. I, I like what? Like. Like hypocrisy. What the fuck? What? Repo hypocrisy is not in a Republican lawmaker's fucking vocabulary. And by the way, Tucker is on his third constipation face. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. <laughs> Let's go. I'm not the only person on screen right now who's been falsely accused of a terrible sex act. <laughs> you were accused of something that you did not do. And so you know what this feels like. You know the pain it can bring to your family. And you know how it, it just puts people on defense when you're accused of something so salacious and awful. But it did not happen. It is. Like, like, wait, 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 wait. <laughs> Motherfucker just threw Tucker Carson under the bus. Like, he just, like, <laughs> the fuck? Like, oh, shit. Like, this is the reason why people don't like Matt Gates. This is the exact reason why. Oh, my God. This is the reason why people don't like Matt Gates. Because this shit right here, this shit right here, this is the reason why I had to do the video. Because he just took Tucker Carson and threw him under the bus. <laughs> Oh God, I love when they eat their own, man. These Tucker's like, you bastard, you bastard. Oh my God, you bastard. L let's go. It's not true. And the fact that it is the basis of this attempt to extort my family tells a lot. And if the FBI and Department of Justice will release the tapes that they are in possession of, the American people will see what is really going on. Oh shit. They, you just referred to a, a mentally ill viewer who accused me of a sex crime 20 years ago. Um, and it, of course, it was—it was not true. I never met the person. Um, but <laughs> Tucker's like, no, 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 nope, not today. Like, don't, no, don't, don't, no, 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 fuck no. Keep your name, keep my name out of your motherfucking mouth. And by the way, it wasn't twenty years ago. <laughs> it was more like six months ago. Mm. Mm. It's almost as if Fox News has a culture of um, being predatory towards people. Like, yeah, no. <laughs> okay, okay, let's go. But I, I do agree with you that being accused falsely is one of the worst things that can happen. And you do see it a lot. Let's go back to the investigation. Um, damn, like, that just broke his motherfucking confidence. That just broke Turk. Like, normally he's just like, hey, hi. He, 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 he was quiet, like like this he was just quiet like oh my god damn it <laughs> oh 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 shit oh shit like, like oh you guys haven't had the best of it yet you haven't had the best of it yet like it, I'm, I'm playing this a little bit lo more than normal but this is fucking awesome like let, we're gonna hit some more let's let's go you you say that it was uh, that it was or is underway, there was an investigation. What is the basis of that investigation? What is the allegation? Is that really- Wait, 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 wait. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I just caught this shit, right? I just caught this shit. Okay, so, y'all see the Chiron on the bottom? Um, how it says, Matt Gates responds to sex trafficking allegation. And underneath the bottom, and I don't know um, if you guys can actually see it on your screen. It says, standing up for what's right, TM. Oh, God. God damn it. I know Cody Johnson makes fun of, uh, make fun of this about um, fair and balanced TM. Like, but when you literally have to trademark your news station's fucking... Um, Motto. It, it that just says so much. Oh God, that just says so much. Um, what's up, cat? What's up, Byron? Oh shit, this like oh God. Okay, oh God. Oh God. Okay, 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 okay. Let Let's go. Not very clear from these news stories. 
Yeah, again, I only know what I've read in the New York Times. Uh, I can say that actually you and I went to dinner uh, about two years ago. Your wife was there, and I brought a friend of mine. You'll remember her. And she was actually threatened by the FBI, told. <laughs> he just keeps throwing him under the bus and keeps rolling back over. <laughs> This is the reason why people don't like Matt Gates. This is the reason why people don't like Matt Gates. Oh, he's just throwing Tucker under the bus. Like, dude, shut the fuck up. Tucker Carlson is like, I know you guys be thinking like, shut the fuck up. He went from his confused face to his just like, dude, shut the fuck up. Stop talking. Stop talking. Stop talking. Shut up shutting up. Like, <laughs> He's like, shut up, shutting up. Get get a tall glass of shut up juice. Like the <laughs> Oh God. It's like he thinks that like haha, I got him. I like he, if I go down, he's going down. It's almost it's almost implying that, hey, the woman that I'm accused of trafficking was the same young lady that we went out to dinner with. Like, <laughs> hey, hey, remember how Republicans and QAnoners were actually saying that um, Democrats were, like, you know, abusing children? I wonder where they, where they got that idea from. I'm just saying. Like, where, where's Marjorie Taylor Greene when it comes to shit like this? Huh? Where is Congresswoman Bobart? Like, where are these motherfuckers when it comes to motherfuckers like Matt Gates? Huh? Where are they at? I'm serious. Like, what? Are, are, like, we're, oh, it gets better. It gets better. That if she wouldn't cop to the fact that somehow I was involved in some pay for play scheme, uh, that she could face trouble. And so uh, I do believe that there are people at the Department of Justice who are trying to smear me, uh, you know, providing for flights uh, and hotel rooms for people that you're dating who are of legal age is not a crime. Uh, and I'm just troubled that the. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Remember in the beginning of the, in the, in the video, he said, it's not true. Remember that. Remember that. Oh God. Remember Oh God. She did not defend his ass. She did not. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. Fuck. It's about playing on that team. If you're on the team, everything you do is great. If you're not, then fuck you, huh? Like what the fuck, man? Oh my God. Like I stopped listening to the uh, Marjorie Taylor Green, but like yeah, like she. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh. <laughs> okay, Byron. It's like a requirement if you're a Republican, you're born on third base, and you have to be a pedo. Yeah. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! Fuck! Wait, like, 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 like. Listen to what the fuck he said, right? He said that paying for hotel rooms and plane tickets for the person that you're dating is, is a crime. Dude, when, when you know, <laughs> I, I saw this post on Facebook, Facebook, when you know the legal age in multiple states, dude, you're a little bit suspect. Like, fuck. God damn it. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh my God. When you know the legal age in multiple states, yeah, you need to be on a list somewhere. Oh my God. And he, like, like the commentary that you get from some of these places, like he was like, he needed a lawyer. He needed a lawyer to tell him to shut the fuck up on Fox News because this, he literally just admitted that somebody that you're dating. Paying for, like the charge was, trafficking somebody who's under the age of 18. He just admitted it. He just fucking admitted it.
And Tucker went from the confused look to the I'm pissed because you keep throwing me under that bus and rolling that motherfucker over me multiple times. And then to the like, shut the fuck up, you idiot. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh. Wow. Let's go. Lack of any sort of legitimate investigation into me would then permute, would then convert into this extortion attempt. I, I, I don't remember the, the woman you're speaking of or the context at all, honestly. <laughs> Tucker knows to do it. He, he has been trained in Fox News HR. Deny, 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 deny. And he's like, I don't even know the woman that you're talking about. <laughs> Tucker Carlson, who is that? His wife? I don't know who the fuck you're talking about. Like, he's just like, he's what? That motherfucker backpedal quicker than. <laughs> He backpedaled quicker than Michael Jackson on a motherfucking uh, moonwalk video. Shit. Oh, God. Oh. <laughs> Let's go. But I, I would like to know who... So they're saying there is a 17-year-old girl who uh, you had a relationship with. Is that true? And who are they? Who is this girl? What are they talking about, I, uh, the New York Times? The person doesn't exist. I have not had a relationship with a 17-year-old. That is totally false. The allegation is... <laughs> I did not have sex with that woman. I did not know who she was. Like, but he just literally said that I used to pay for some travel ticket, tra paying for travel and hotels for somebody that you're dating. Like, God damn it. Like, fuck. Okay, okay. Oh, wow. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah. Like, which is it, dog? That is not a problem that you were actually paying for a travel for somebody that you're dating, or that you don't know who this woman is. Which is it? Which is it? Please, Matt Gates, in your infinite I almost said wisdom. In your infinite stupidity. <laughs> oh, that's easy, Byron. His daddy has money. He's a fail son. That's all he is. He's a fail son. These look, these are two fail sons on the screen. Tucker Carlson is the heir to the Swanson family fucking fortune. They're both fail sons. This is this mediocrity shit that because of a certain amount of money that they have, that they can do no fucking wrong. You know, Tucker Carlson, this is the third network that he's been on that he's like he, he's finally getting some prominence on. He's failed on CNN. He failed on MSNBC. This is the third network that he has been on. People forget that he was that bow tie wear wearing idiot on CNN and NBC. And he looked like a fucking nerd. I'm just saying. This this is not this is not Tucker Carlson's first rodeo. They're of they're both fail sons. That only get by because they can make money and not along to the to the right shit. But let's go. As I read it in the New York Times is that I've traveled with some 17 year old in some relationship that is false and records will bear that out to be false. How, how long has this investigation been going on? Do you know, I, I don't know. When oh, God, wait, wait. And if we were to just talk about Matt Gates, do you know he's. <laughs> One of the, the, the chicks that he was dating, he adopted their brother, his son, Nestor, uh, his son, Nestor, because he was, he needed cover for like the racist shit that he says. How can I be racist? I'm a father to Nestor of child of color. Like, yeah. Oh God. I, this isn't the Matt Gates show. Oh, this is a Matt Gates video clip, but still, you know what I mean? When were you first informed of that? Uh, you know, again, I, I, I really saw this as a deeply troubling challenge for my family on March 16th when people were, you know, talking about a, a minor and that there were pictures of me with child prostitutes. Uh, <laughs> obviously false. There will be no such pictures because no such thing happened. Um, but really on March 16th was when this got going uh, from the extortion standpoint. I mean, like, how much of a little limp dick motherfucker do you have to be to actually date somebody that's more than half, that's, that's less than half your age? I mean, like, I, 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 like, how much, how insecure do you have to be? Like, seriously, how insecure do you have to be to, like, have to, like, he, 
he now denies the relationship, but like, oh my god, they have pictures, man. They have pictures, and you don't have the charisma of the fucking orange Cheeto. You don't, man. But like, all right, let's let's go, let's go. So what what happens next? I mean, you, you can see there is this investigation. I guess a criminal investigation. I'm not quite sure where the sex trafficking part comes in. I don't. Again, for the fifth time, I don't really understand the story very well. But wh where does it go from here? I mean, you're, you've made an allegation against someone by name on the air and accused him of trying to extort millions of dollars from your family. What? So the the thing about him naming somebody on air and trying to extort, like literally, um, and I probably should have been a little bit more responsible with blotting that out, but I didn't know the name was coming up. Um, but this motherfucker is a lawyer. I'm pretty sure that a lawyer may know how to fucking deal with this shit, especially one with the Department of Justice. Um, you done fucked up. You done fucked up. You done goofed by trying to bully this fucking Department of, of Justice official, especially when the former Department of Justice heads didn't like you and the current Department of Justice heads don't like you. I mean, like it's just—it's like that meme where Arnold and uh, uh that that from Predator was like, ah, the Republican hatreds of Matt Gates, Democratic hatreds of Matt Gates. Ah, Matt Gates is fucked. Like the fuck. <laughs> All right, uh, let's go. What happens tomorrow? Well, what was oh. supposed to happen uh, was the transfer of this money that would have implicated the former colleague of these current DOJ officials. But that's obviously not going to happen tomorrow because the New York Times story was leaked in order to quell that investigative effort. So here's what needs to happen next. The FBI and the Department of Justice must release the tapes that are in their possession that were done at their direction. Those tapes will show that I am innocent and that the whole concept of sex charges against me was really just a way to try to bleed my family out of money and probably smear my name because I... Win, 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 win. You caught me doing some shit that I shouldn't have done. Like, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. All right. So, you know, um, when did this video come out? Um, huh? March the thirtieth. Three days ago. Wait. It would have been the the ninth. So thirty first. Yesterday, today, three days ago. You know what didn't come out? You know what didn't cut out? You know what didn't come out? Tapes. Tapes didn't come out. Tapes didn't come out. Oh, oh, oh. oh. The tapes didn't come out. The, it wasn't on the tapes. Oh. Uh, let's, let's go. Let's go. I am a well-known, outspoken conservative, and I guess that's out of style in a lot of parts of the country right now. Oh, yeah. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I, I'm sorry I missed this on the first comment. Yes, Grand Ultimate. He was the only one to vote no on the human trafficking bill. Yes, he was. We see why. We see why. It will cut down his dating pool to zero. Anyway, let's go. Matt Gates, I appreciate you coming on tonight. So Thanks for giving me the I'm chance more, to talk more, truth. I'm more, I appreciate it. Uh, I, it's a more interesting and complicated story than, than I knew from reading about. Thank you very much. All right, so the reason why I want to make it through this whole video is because of this. Watch this shit. Watch this shit. Mac Gates interview. That was one of the weirdest interviews I've ever conducted. That story just appeared in the news a couple of hours ago. And on the certainty that there's always more than you read in the newspaper, we immediately called Mac Gates and asked him to come on and tell us more, which, as you saw, he did. I don't think that clarified much, uh, but it certainly showed this is a deeply interesting story, and we'll be, we'll be following it. <laughs> oh shit. Oh shit. Oh wow. Um wow. Oh wow. That 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 was fucking priceless. You know what you don't do? You don't there are no honor of motherfucking thieves or republicans as I see. Like 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 no, like fuck like Oh wow shit oh wow there is no honor <laughs> at all fuck <laughs> like <laughs> Tucker had to get that last little jab he was like it was the weirdest interview I ever heard I mean like what the fuck man oh god 
It's like Matt Gates was just like, if I go down, I'm taking all your motherfuckers out. And you remember, like, let's let's, let's just talk about the funny, um, um, just Matt Gates shit. Do you know he was just like super creepy to Tiffany Trump, like super creepy. Like I, mm, can I find that? Um, let's see. Move my keyboard over here. Yep, got it. Let's see if we got images. Let's see, let's see, let's see. I'm pulling it up now, guys. Sorry about that. If, um, hmm. Like, take a look at this shit. Take a look at this shit. Now, okay, I get it. Like, somebody should show Tiffany Trump some type of attention because Donald Trump never did. But, like, <laughs> like, dude was thirst posted for Tiffany Trump. The fuck? Oh, God. Oh, God. I don't like I I I don't I don't get it. I don't fucking get it. It's like how could you be a sick of it and then just get ready to throw people under the bus like that? I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Oh wow. Oh god. Shit. Well if you like the shit that I do, please, please like, share, and subscribe. Um I do this shit. Um, <laughs> I, I just the last two comments that came in, like the uh, and try to marry to the Trumps. Yeah, uh, is fucking right. But if you like the shit that I do, I do this live every Monday and Wednesday, and sometimes Friday, seven thirty Central PM Standard Time. Fuck, seven thirty PM Central Standard Time. I do a live show with clips released every day. Um, if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button for my YouTube channel. And um, yeah, come join us live. Come, we're fuck it to we're fuck it, we're doing it live. Um, and um, if you want to actually help out the channel, you can actually check out the top where my streamlabs is to help support the channel, or then the bottom in my Patreon. Oh shit! Oh god. Hey guys, this is me, Crimson60620. And if you ever want to actually get some great art and help support my channel, help support me, check out my merch page at streamlabs.com forward slash Crimson60620 backslash merch. Here you can actually find um, great pieces of art put on t shirts and it'll be updated frequently with a lot of my other art. So, Thank you for support and please enjoy the video. Thanks.